Consider the following problem. Find two numbers whose sum is 23 and whose product is a maximum. Make a table of values like the following one so that the sum of the numbers in the first two columns is always 23. On the basis of the evidence in your table, estimate the answer to the problem. So you can see we started with 1, 1 plus 22 is 23 and the product is 22. 2 plus 21 is 23, the product is 42. So we'll go ahead and just continue on with this table. We'll have 4, and that'll be a 19 here, and then 5 and 18. 6 plus 17 is 23. If you don't mind me going outside the lines, I'll just keep on going. 7 plus what? 16 is 23. 8 plus 15 is 23. 9 plus 14 is 23. 10 plus 13 is 23. 11 plus 12 is 23, and there's no sense in going any farther. We could do 12 and 11, but that's going to give us the same product as 11 and 12. So let's go ahead and fill out the products then for all these. 4 times 19, that's uh, 76. 5 times 18 is, what's that? Yeah, 90, I believe. 6 times 17, bigger yet, that's 102. 7 times 16 is how much? Yeah, 112. 8 times 15, don't tell me, I know it, 120. 9 times 14 is 126. Getting bigger. 10 times 13 is 130. And 11 times 12 is 132. It looks like, based on our table here, that the biggest product comes from 11 and 12. Those two numbers have a sum of 23, and they have the biggest product of all the numbers that we looked at. So I would say then that the answer appears to be 11 and 12. But caution, we only were considering integers here, weren't we? Hmm.